Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to RimWorld! Oh boy, people have been saying this is a dumb idea, mainly- oh, I didn't- hmm. People have been saying this is a dumb idea, uh, because the, uh, this- the, 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 this doesn't keep plants growing for 24 hours anymore, that that has been changed. I'm going to double check that. Uh, when night rolls around and make sure that's the case. It used to be the case in old RimWorld. That's what people are saying. In old, old RimWorld, that's how it used to be, but not so much anymore. But even if that isn't the case anymore, this is still a cool project, and I think it looks cool, and I'm into it. And I can expand this zone uh, a lot, a lot easier. Um, also, people are saying that this hallway is getting really hot because these two things are spewing hot air into here. Um, and that's one of the reasons this is not freezing anymore. Um, so what I need to do is just hold these open for now. And uh, let the heat just kind of spew out from both sides. A new refrigerator is also something I think we should probably endeavor to, to work toward. Really at this point, it's all about being able to... Uh, to optimize our, our colony. Our colony is in such a, a pretty damn nice self-sustaining spot that we're, we're pretty much in a, in a in a decently winnable situation um other things i'm going to end up doing is like placing sandbags all over the place at some point um so that the enemies have to walk over them and slows them down for more getting shot at uh lots and lots of things that i want to do lots and lots and lots of things this is on right yeah so no nothing has flown over Another thing I'm going to end up doing is actually slapping a door down. Like, when these break down, I can't get to them. I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. This is actually poor on my part. I'm going to cancel this. I think... Yeah, I think I'm going to keep that canceled for now. I don't know how I'm going to get to this one if it ends up getting fucked. But I guess we'll find out all in due time. I'm glad to see we're hauling things, though. We'll leave this up. I'm gonna leave this space open so I can get to these two. I could put a, a door down. And that would help. Who's in a poor mood? Mathis is in a poor mood. Husband died. Okay, so... Observed a rotting corpse. Where is there a rotting corpse? Oh, dude, we gotta get rid of this thing. Mathis, do me a favor. Wait, what? No empty place to configure it. Right here, man! Why can't we get rid of this? No empty place to store it. It's right... Right here, man. Was Rose one of ours? No, this is Faction the Panthers. She died from, uh... From infection. I don't understand. This is very confusing to me. No empty grave to store it. No empty place configured to store it. That's a, that's a huge, huge, huge lie. What? Try again. I don't understand. I can't get rid of it? And I'm not 100% sure why. Well, what if we just allow stranger corpses in here? And we can bury Rose. We might as well. For some reason, it's not allowing them to, to get buried over here. That's really strange to me. Sorry about that, Rob, for uh, doing that. Um, she was not considered a stranger for some reason, and I couldn't bury her. I had to, I had to bury her, rather. That confuses me incredibly. Dan, can we prioritize? No empty place to haul it. This is super confusing. Um, mechanoid corpses, animal corpses. Now can I? Okay, we can at least haul the scyther now. 
Who's a Smith? Who's our Smiths right now? Bear is a Smith. Rob is a Smith. I'm a Smith. You're a Smith. He's a Smith. We're all Smiths. Hey, I'm a Smith. You're a Smith. He's a Smith. We're all Smiths. I'm excited to see how much power we're gonna end up using. I'm gonna let the store for a bit. Mad animals. All right. How many? Is it just this tortoise? Tortoise is like really. This tortoise is pissed. He's coming for vengeance. He's gonna get to us. Kate, just fucking fire at him. Dan, you just do your thing, dude. I know you're afraid of it, but you're fine. Just let it bleed out. Kate's gonna take care of it. We're not gonna rescue the. What are you guys doing? Why are you cowering? Just kill it. Here, melee it. Beat the shit out of it. Oh, there's another one. Multiple mad animals. All right, well. Dan! Damn it, Dan, stop running from a turtle, man! Dan, it's not worth running from a turtle, all right? Thank you. It's just not. Like, there's more things to be afraid of. A turtle is like the least of your concerns. As far as I'm concerned, it's the least of your concerns anyway. God damn, dude. That was dumb. What? Do I hear another? Tor God, bear. Come here. Kill it. Here. Rob. Come here. We're gonna put you right, you know, we're gonna put you right here. And we're gonna have you shoot at it. Kate is terrified of it. We're gonna go boom. I'm gonna actually have you melee attack the tortoise to death. Just beat it. Just beat it. You gotta bite. You know what? Fuck it. You gotta bite. Oh well. Don't be a punk bitch. We don't need to forbid this one anymore. Okay, there we go. More food. Beautiful. I'm even gonna hook bear up. I feel like we shouldn't have used that great, like, high quality medicine, but, you know, whatever. Nick is starving. What? Nick! Nick! Dog! Come the fuck here. What are you doing? Why must you run from the goddamn turtle, my man? Seriously, you're starving to death. It's just not worth you dying. Thank you for eating. Goddamn, dude. Why are you guys terrified of turtles? the dumbest thing to be afraid of. You could be afraid of so many more legitimate things. But turtles is what you choose. Ah, oh, you guys throw me for a goddamn loop. Drives me nuts. Drives me nuts. All right. Um, let's do two. Boom. I'm going to bring you down to 3. Uh, there's a turtle. Bear. Quick. Be afraid, dog. Come here. Shoot it. Come on, bear. You got this. Here, we're gonna get close. Don't shoot your... All right, bear, come here, come here. You got this, bear. I have faith in you, man. There we go. There we go. Shoot everything off, man. Thank you. You know what? Melee attack it. Fuck it's up, man. Fuck it's life up. Fuck turtles. Eat shit, turtle bro. Can we please get to like times three speed? That'd be awesome. Beat it. Just beat it. There you go. Good job. Congratulations, you beat the turtle to death. Proud of you. I'm proud of you, fam. Who's got a melee weapon right now? Kate, do you have a, no, you have a gun, you have a gun. You have a melee weapon, you're incapable of violence. Nick, no, you've all got guns. You know what, more power to you for the guns. I, I, I appreciate it. One colonist is idle, it's Dan. Why is Dan idle right now? Here, Dan, if you're gonna be idle, fucking do some research or some shit. Can you smith actually, if you're idle, smith. Don't research, just smith. There you go, bear. I mean, Dan, okay, you're planting. Dan, didn't I? Dan, I said you could smith. Dan. Did I, oh, it already got chopped up. 
Never mind then. I'm an idiot. Alright, let's see. Well, we might as well start dragging power in. And we'll see what it's going to be looking like for us here. Either way, uh, it's going to be fun. I forgot to check at night, like, if stuff was still growing. This is a power test as of right now. We'll go ahead and slap that on. Little switch to turn it on and off. All right, things are going well. Like it's so nice to see my busy little bees just flying around, doing well, being happy. Um, I forgot to check. I need power there. Let me throw a wire on that, please. Okay, so over here, growth rate zero. Over here, growth rate 100. Wait. But they're resting. So the growth rate says 100, but they're actually not growing at all. Is that my understanding? So they, they rest no matter what that they rest. Even though it says growth rate 100, they rest. Weird. I'm trying to think what the purpose of um, sun lamps would be, and I guess hydroponics and growing indoors in that regard would be, would be I guess, what you would want. Minus 8,000 watts. Holy shit. That eats up so much power. Can we gain watts when the sun is up, though? I don't think so. I think these only produce what? Two, four, six thousand watts, maybe, total, all told? We'll find out. No, not even. All right. Turn this off. Okay. Huh. Well. We could do a no roof zone and keep our farming regulated to in here. I'd still like to use an expand out this way. So let's go ahead and um, let's zone. Yeah, all right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna deconstruct these. It's unfortunate because it's a kind of a waste. I guess during cloudy days it would be all right. We can actually leave them in there for now. But we're gonna go ahead and allow sowing. And then remove no roof area. Remove the roof from in there. Open the sucker up. And let things go. Yep. There we go. It's going to take a while. But it'll be valuable for us to do it this way. We can deconstruct, 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 deconstruct. <gasps> Roof collapse. Oh shit. Dan and Nick got fucked up. Well, don't do that. They collapsed right on their faces. And it's trivial, luckily. They just got a cut. But still. It's not what you want. I guess we could continue, like, hoping. Please tell me it's just a cut. Yeah, it is. All right, guys. You're going to have to risk it for now. Maybe I should have waited for the roof to be undone first. But oh well. Colonist needs treatment. They'll be okay. We're just not going to worry about power, powering these things on right now. Same with this. This is like a waste. Let's deconstruct that. This doesn't help like I thought it was. But once we have everything planted here, I can start closing up these areas nicely. Uh, okay, so first I got to do potatoes. Corn. Uh, then we want cotton. Even though we don't need it that much, it's still good to have, I think. Strawberries. 
somewhere strawberries would be good no no strawberries am i just missing it there it is strawberries hops rice and all that other good stuff so we'll do rice hops we don't do i really want more hops like i have a lot of hops i could grow other things but i guess for now and then heal root i'll just leave it for now i'm gonna cancel this delete this zone keep these getting slowly get rid of them and start moving up oh shit okay well it's raining we're good we good fam we good we're being raided however they are, they are attacking immediately yo what do they have charge rifle pistol charge rifle but he's got a helmet on they both have helmets on all right um let's turn this on everybody but kate because kate doesn't fucking know or matt it's not everybody but matt this rather up and at him Dan, I'm actually gonna have you, yep. Okay, let's go over here. All right, here's how we gotta do this. Dan, you have nothing. Why do you have nothing, dog? Come here, get this pistol. Nick, uh, let's do you here. So let's do you here. And then Dan, over here. Nick, here. Dan, I'm actually going to put you here. Okay, let's hope this works. Headshot. Here they come. They've got a long walk, but we get a charge rifle out of this. Or two. Oh no, you all died. How uh, how shameful. How, how sad. Rob. Actually, who's our best shot right now? Character shot is not Bear. I think it's Nick. All right, Nick. First and foremost, you're getting this one. Equip this. Who's our next best, best shot? Because that's Nick. He's 13. Six, six, but K actually has like an affinity for it. Matt, this can't do shit. Dan. So actually, it's going to be Kate. Kate, you're going to grab this. Okay, and then I'm going to have you strip. This is a force helmet thing. Nick strip. Where? Where? Strip. All right. Do you have body armor, Nick? You do. I think I'm gonna have you wear this one. It's better off. Kate, you are wearing body armor. It's better than that one. All right. You guys got helmets. You're looking fucking good. Fly as fuck, as some may say. Turn off our turrets, save our power. Rob's just shooting hoops. Everything's good, man. Life in the colony is super excellent. Could you guys just start planting over here, though? And also, what I'm going to do is make this critical. So we store things there first. Everything good? Don't let him die. He's plopping some dead bodies around. No worries. Rob, are you a decent shot? Four, two, bear is six. Bear, what are you carrying? You have the assault rifle, so I guess Rob is that. Do I want to give him this? Here, Dan. Come take the PDW. I don't know if I like the fact that you're going to wear the PDW, but whatever at this point, whatever. All right, let's close, let's delete that one. Nick is taking wood. Okay, he's refueling some torches. No, we don't want. I'm going to delete this and that. Let those grow for the rest. Delete those. Can you? Okay, there we go. That's what I want to see. Planting in our new fangled protected garden. That's what I want. Once these are 
harvested. I want these harvested first. We should probably just order them. I don't know if I have to manually order them to be harvested, but I need to get them harvested so I can plant some walls or place some walls down. But we're going to have to start looking at, like I said, making this all work out nicely for us. This turret, I don't know. Um, we'll reinstall this for now. We could use this as like secondary defenses. Where'd that steel come from? But I think, yeah, moving that down and then kind of connecting these buildings, maybe putting a wall here and breaking these walls down, having a much bigger rec room could be good. Once electric smelting is done, a smithy alloy fuels. Let's see what that does for us. Multi analyzer. High tech research branch. We might need a better research table. I don't know if that's possible. High tech research. So, yeah, that's what we need. Um, all right, we're going to do is take this zone. And then we're going to delete that part of the zone. Go down like so. And then this is going to be an extension of the rec room. We'll have a new way to enter the storage area. That, um, heat wave, not a huge deal. The prison is a little bit problematic where it is, but we'll see. Open up the rec room quite a bit. Heat wave is, is a little bit of a worry for me, but not too much of one. Yeah, we just need to bring these down and store them all. Uh, we're going to have to put a door here so people can move through. Do we have any more wood? We may need to chop wood. Which is funny, because we haven't done that in a long time. Yeah, let's get rid of this, 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 and this. And maybe building a, a tree farm over here or something could be worth it for us. Just for the wood itself. And then we can make this. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Do like oak trees over here. Just start growing trees that we can uh, repeatedly use. And I'm gonna wanna floor this whole thing up so there's no trees growing over here too at some point. So there's no cover that they can uh, use. Where is planning? Cancel that right there because it's looking at me and annoying me. But we have to have plants somewhere. Or, tr or wood somewhere, rather. Alright, we can now do more stuff. Before I worry about doing any more stuff, let's break all this down. Like that. I might just leave this room as it is. And, he's, and not wall it off anymore. Let's deconstruct this. Um, let's go ahead and slap a cooler in here. 
High tech research. Electric smelter as well. High tech, re high tech research bench. It's definitely one thing we want. Let's put that up there. I think we can afford the power, so I'm not really worried. We may want to order the chopping of more wood out here so we can get more. Oh, we have a, I forgot we had a bunch of weapons stored up here. I'm over here looking for weapons. I'm like, what can I hook up my dudes with? He needs a better pistol. No, we have an entire area that we have we can dedicate to that. All right, we're gonna have to cut plants. So we can actually do some stuff over here. All right, I think we're gonna have to stop the episode here. I didn't realize we were 26 minutes in. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying our RimWorld project. Things are going quite nicely. If you are, come back next time for some more. Consider dropping a like. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.